Yo, what is going on on YouTube? It's your boy Breakstone. In today's video, I'm going to be showcasing you guys basically how to speed up your Ryu Jinx emulator to max performance on the PC. But before we get started this video, please make sure guys you like, share, and also subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Let's get it. Now, do keep in mind that this method only works if you guys have a really strong PC. So what I mean by that is you have something like i7 with the latest Nvidia with the latest video graphics card like a 2080, uh, 3020, 3060, and you have like 32 gigs of RAMs, like a really powerful PC. If you guys don't have that or anything close to that, this may not work for you. 90% to 95% is not gonna work. So don't even try on the comments under the comment section. So yeah, how this basically is going to work is you're going to need the the un, unlocked FPS mod, basically trying to push your game to 120 FPS, trying to basically push it push it to max speed, which I'll also leave in the description down below. Now this is very game dependent, but the games are really a um I'll say it works best best with is basically the the first party AAA popular games like Pokemon Sword and Shield, Animal Crossing, Mario Odyssey, games of that sort. I'm not too sure if it works with other games. You guys can give that a try and basically say it under the comment section if it does or it does not work. It really doesn't matter to me. All I know is it works with most um, popular AAA Nintendo games. All right, so how you basically work this mod is basically gonna left click, open mod directory, now we're gonna delete these old mods. Just delete this. Then we're gonna use the unlock FPS mod. And also you can use the ultra widescreen mod. This is just to make the screen a lot more larger. It really, if, it really doesn't do much for me, but it's pretty cool to have. But the unlock FPS is the most important one. This is this uh, mod, FPS mod, basically trying to push the game to 120 FPS or as closely as possible to it. So do keep in mind with that. You need a really strong PC. Now with the settings, um, like I said, you, there's not much settings with the Ryu Jinx emulator. Um, let's enable this. Always enable this. Put this to auto. Um, 16 by nine. Uh, native is good. Like I said, if you're trying to play games in 4K using the 4X and native scale, it's Pretty good, pretty solid. Basically, gonna save that, apply it, and that's basically about it. I will show gameplay, but I'm not risking it because Nintendo, as you guys may or may not know, I'm heavily targeted with Nintendo when I'm showing emulation gameplay. They love to take the video down, and I'm not trying to risk it today. So, yeah, that's basically about it for the video. If you guys enjoyed the video, Feel free to like, share, and also subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. And yeah, guys, this is your boy Bravetone. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.